How's it going, everyone? This is Crypto Foxy. Hope you're having an awesome day. Crypto Tank is uh, sniffing my feet there. My cat, he snuck in. Um, I'm just going to let him roam around. So if you see a cat in the background, it's uh, just Crypto Cat Tank there. Um, yeah, so in this video, I want to talk to you a bit about uh, XRP and Ripple. And uh, I heard a, a statistic today, and uh, I just want to put it in your guys' heads. How much of uh, Ripple's business do you think is outside the United States? Um, the number will uh, shock the, the heck out of me, I'll tell you that. Um, so before we get into it, though, please remember to like the video, uh, subscribe to my channel, and let's get into it. All right, so in this video, I want to talk to you about Ripple and how they're attracting investors in Dubai. And I want to talk a bit about uh, their, their global reach as well. Um, so Ripple continues to attract institutional investors in Dubai. Despite the current SEC case, Ripple continues to pursue global expansion with a significant foray into the Dubai and Middle East and North Africa markets. Um, so it's M-E-N-A, so Middle East and North Africa. Um, Ripple has increased its footprint in Dubai in May of this year by opening a new office space in the Dubai in International Financial Center. Ripple CEO Brad Garlinghouse at the Dubai FinTech Summit uh, XRP Ledger currently has over 4.8 million wallets with 20% of clients originating from, uh, originating from the MENA region. That's a pretty significant uh, representation on their part. Um, so there is substantial interest and demand for Ripple-based solutions in this space. Um, so here's the answer to the question I asked you previously. 90% of its business operating outside of the United States. 90% of Ripple's business is outside of the United States. So we think for a moment the SEC, yeah, the SEC might be driving the price down of Ripple. Um, you know, the lawsuit drags on or whatever. And, uh, you know, United States uh, holders are maybe maybe holding off on, on investing into uh, Ripple or XRP. Well, the rest of the world is continuing to move on, right? And, uh, you know, if Ripple, Ripple's going to fight the SEC, but they're also going to expand globally. So I think this is really smart on their point or on their uh, behalf, because no matter what happens in the United States, they still have the rest of the world. And the rest of the world is a bigger market. So they're, uh, you know, they're making sure that they have, you know, their stakes set elsewhere just in case things do blow up in the United States. Um, it, we still don't know what... Uh, what uh, regulation is going to look like when it does come down. So they're, they're preparing right now. So it's awesome to see. Uh, XRP payments are becoming more popular as crypto adoption does grow. Bitpo BitPay is a cryptocurrency payment processor, and they recently tweeted about two companies accepting XRP through its platform. Uh, ExpressVPN is a well-known VPN service provider uh, from the British Virgin Islands, registered business Express technology, and it now takes XRP via BitPay. That's awesome. I didn't know that. Uh, so there was a tweet from the payment processor and uh, they announced that service. In addition, uh, digital games marketplace Kingwin is now accepting XRP payments via BitPay, allowing uh, players to game with ease and the speed of XRP. So no matter what happens here, no matter what happens in North America, uh, XRP Ripple is still um, expanding its global, its global reach. And, uh, you know, they're, they're continuing to build. I can't see them slowing down anytime soon. You know, they're all about cross-border payments, liquidity services, et cetera. And, uh, you know, they've, the sky's the limit. It's uh, awesome to see. I'm not too worried. I know the price of XRP right now is down because of the lawsuit, as well as the, uh, you know, macroeconomic factors that are going on, inflation, et cetera. And um, once we get into the next bull run, I'm super excited to see where we're going to go with XRP. That's what I got for you in this video. Uh, Crypto Cat says, oh, he's having a nap on the floor. Um, so we'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.